Hello JSP squad and welcome back to my channel. It is Jasmine and we are here for a fitness video today. So if you've been watching for a while and you're not officially a part of the JSP squad, go ahead and click that red subscribe button down below the notification bell next to it because you don't want to miss another video with me. So you guys, if you saw my video yesterday, and I'll link that at the end of the video, maybe I'll go ahead and put it up in the iCard so that way you can click it now if you want to go check that video out. But I ended up buying a wellness planner. I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to keep it, um, but it has the layout that I do like. So it has the intentions, then it has the nourish, and then it has um, movement, and then it has an area where you can... Um, write down thoughts and stuff like that, like a journaling section. So, cause you know guys, you know, I put my little journaling section up here and then, you know, sometimes I'll, for my focus it's usually like motivational quotes or just decoration, definitely lock my food and I put my exercise down here. So my steps and then whatever exercise I've done. So now I think I'm gonna do something a little bit different. I'm probably gonna have to pull another sticker book um, because I definitely wanna keep track of my calories on paper. I am using it on um, fitness, not fitness blender, my fitness pal now. So I went ahead and I downloaded that because I do remember that when I did lose about 20, 30 pounds um, two years ago, I was actually using my fitness pal and logging my calories. And I think that had something to do with it. Also, I went vegan for like six months also. So I think that had something to do with it. And I was working out consistently. So again, I think that had something to do with it too. But... I don't know if I'm going to keep the wellness planner because I also got Stargazer and Your Year to Shine that I wanted to use combined together for wellness and fitness. And I just got to figure out a way to use it. And if I can figure it out, I'm not going to get the fitness planner that they're going to come out with later, maybe. And um, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, do, you know, deal with what I have. And actually, I thought I was going to have to switch out. Oh, yeah, I probably will have to get a colorful boxes. Um, but, or I might grab the, actually, I don't even know if that's going to fit. Okay, so we are going to go ahead and put down these for our food. Let me see if they have any in here. Yes, a few. Actually, I don't want to use... Maybe we can use these and put them in the corners just for our total calories for the day. So I think this is a different look. So we can track the calories and put them over here. So what it says is that I shouldn't have more than 1700 calories. So. We will see how that goes. I haven't really gotten that hungry just eating that. I think at night sometimes I think I get a little bit more hungrier. Um, I'm so used to eating at night and I haven't in the last several days. So that is, that is tough for me. That is one thing that I am trying to break a habit of. I don't know why I could do this stuff before I was, like, I used to do this on a regular basis, you guys. Not, like, dieting and stuff like that. Definitely not dieting because I don't, I don't like doing diets. I like to do a lifestyle change. And, like, eating at night was one thing that was easy for me to cut out. So, I have no idea why the odor I've gotten, it's been harder for me to do. It's ridiculous. I don't I don't understand that part. Does anybody else struggle with eating at night and like learning how to change their habits up? I guess that, that might just be like an old people thing. Ugh. Because yes, I totally think I am just a little bit old. I'm really not that old, you guys. Um but definitely feel that way in a sense of trying to get my life under control, weight under control, because of course the older you get, the harder it becomes. Body goes through a whole lot of changes as you get older. So, I just don't know. So we're gonna use all of these on 
this page, which is fine. We're on a mission to use all the stickers. And you guys, I, I haven't seen this book in a while, so or I haven't used this book in a while, I mean. Um, so yeah, decided to whip out that free spirit. Start using it. Because it's a cute book. It also gives me vibes of the new book that just came out, Dream Seeker, of course. It's really cute. All right, so I think the hard part is done, which is down at the bottom. That's usually the part that is the hardest to get done. So what we are going to do is put some of these flowers down here to just make this section stand out a little bit more. So let's put a few of these in different errors to make it cuter, definitely. Let's put this one down here, and then let's get a full blown rose gold one. Or is this copper? We've always said rose gold, but now they've come out with the copper. So maybe this is copper. Hmm. Questions. I don't know. Um, and then I thought about putting one of these down. Reach for the stars. Which side do I want to put it on? I think I want to do it on this side. So let me get my white pen and kind of get rid of some of this stuff right here in the center. I think I'm gonna chill on the dark pink lines. I think it'll be all right. Now I'm gonna put that there. It's actually, oh, I think that was like a pin. Okay, now that silver is always so pretty too. All right, so as far, like you guys, I feel like I'm on track right now. Like. I don't know what has taken place. I think putting my picture out there because I want y'all to see a difference. So I think that is what has changed in my mindset because I'm like, whoa, I put my whole body out there and they're going to be looking for a change. And if I don't give them a change, they're going to be like, Jasmine, what are you doing with your life? Because I'm not seeing a difference, you know, I'm not seeing the difference. Now in, in November, you might not see a difference because they said, I try to remember what they say. It takes like four weeks for you to see a difference. Six weeks. I, I can't remember, but I want to say it says something about by week eight. Other people can see your progress. I don't really know. Don't quote me on that. But I'm pretty sure that's what they said. Something along those lines. But I really don't know. So, yeah. Don't quote me on that. Um, I'm not really sure. I kind of feel like I want to use one more of these. I think I will do a purple one. But I want to do it on this side. So, I think I will, I'll do this one. And I'll put it on Thursday. Actually, because I want one on Saturday too. So... We're going to do it there for Friday. So that one's for Friday. And then I'm going to get a smaller one to put in these two areas. So let's go ahead and grab that. So we're going to do a peach over here. And we're going to deck this peach out with... What are we going to deck it out with? What are we going to deck it out with? Yeah, don't, don't worry about that, you guys. Um... Let's get some of these greens. These little green. Should we put it behind? Let's put one behind and then one on top. One on top right here. Okay, because, oops, I forgot. We need one for Tuesday too. And if I'm putting that I'm just gonna cover up just a little bit. That's fine. Okay. Yeah, that works out perfect. That's good. All right, but I do need another one for Tuesday. Oh yeah, I could use one of these. All right, so I'll use this little purple one right here, which will be good. So that is for 
Tuesday. Let's line it up so it'll be pretty. Well, at least pretty straight anyway. All right, so that works there. All right, now let's go back and get our, this thing right here. We're using this. Reach for the stars. Yes. We're going to reach for the stars right here. I'm going to go ahead and lay that one down. Oh, so pretty. Oh. No, you guys, I'm sorry. Um... So, okay, so I did see that other people said that they were like, yes, I'm going to be on that train. I'm going to get up there with you, girl, or whatever. So let me know down in the comments. Have y'all, I've been trying to look for you guys' reply once I um, put it up there. Um, the replies get lost within, I think I have to go to the actual video and try to see if you have responded to what I have said. Um, that just takes a little bit more work to actually go and search through all the videos to find your comments. Um, but um, I do try to respond and get, you know, get that out there and make sure that y'all know that I am reading your responses and I am staying up to date with what you are telling me and what you are trying to do with your goals. But then once I reply, it's kind of just difficult for me to go back and try to find it because it gets lost in my email. And I'm always trying to look to see if anybody has replied. And I don't ever really see too many people that have replied back to me. So I'm just not 100% sure if you have or haven't or, you know, what's going on there. So I would definitely love to know if you have responded and what you said, like, you know, how's your, how's your journey going and did you even start? So that's usually the hardest part is getting up there and actually starting. So let's go back up here and we are almost done. We're gonna do some decorative elements cause y'all know I like my decorations. But we're gonna get some of these uh, quotes that were up here. Weren't they up here? I thought they were up here. Let's see. No, where are they? In the back? Nope, that's not them either. Okay, here we go. All right, so without rain, nothing grows. Learn to embrace the storms of your life. I want to put this one down. I'm going to put it down over here on Sunday. But to me, when it says rain, I'm going to indicate that as sweat. All right, good old sweat coming out of your body and just... Uh, just letting go of all of that negative energy and everything else just coming out of you. And no matter how tired you are, you didn't push through that workout and you irritated because you didn't push through the workout. But at the end, I do feel better after I have worked out. But let me tell you something. I'm not happy about it while I'm doing it. I'm not. And I'm just, because uh, I'm tired. I'm tired. And I know, I think I have told y'all before, like it's, irritating because I've done these workouts before and the fact that it is so hard for me is it just makes me angry <laughs> it just makes me angry <laughs> oh, my kids be laughing at me because I'd be so mad I'm like please don't I need to get up early so I don't have to work out with them because they be making me mad because they be they ask me a whole lot of questions while I'm working out. And I'm like, please don't ask me nothing while I'm working out. I'm mad. Mama's mad right now, okay? Like, give me two seconds. Let me recuperate. And then we can talk about it. All right? Because I'm just not happy right now. I'm just be angry. But, hey, it happens. <sighs> Let's see. Now I lost that quote again. Oh, here we go. And it says, good energy is contagious. So, like, yeah, I feel good now. I done made myself all pretty and whatnot. My my husband called and he was like, you so pretty. I was like, oh, thank you so much, babe. Um, So, yeah. We got to... I, was, I got pretty today. Which, I got pretty yesterday, too. So, I think I'm going to put this one down. I don't know if it will fit right here. Yes, it will. So, this one's it. I'm going to bring it right down here. 
and it says wild heart all right and then that just ties in the flowers and i'm gonna throw down over here oh i needed a few stars on this side too so i'm gonna get the rose gold stars and put a few of them up here um so stars there because that's what we're doing we are reaching for the stars from here on out and we are going to make it aren't we folks i know y'all are excited i know that y'all are excited i know it i can feel it and we are going to conquer it and I, we're going to have we're going to have lots of energy stamina endurance and great bodies because somebody was like forget everything else live a healthy life and just make sure that you get your um the fact that you get a great body is a bonus and she right she is right i was like yes that is right because that's what, that's all I want right now is stamina, okay? I just want to be able to withstand my workouts without being so angry about it, okay? Because <laughs> grumpy city over here, all right? Let me tell you, not a happy camper. All right, that is super cute. So I think I'm going to do one more. No, I'm not because I don't have enough. So um, I think I will put one right over here um on this side this is and last time i just wrote down my goals for the week not last week because i still have failed to plan to put in all my stuff for, for last week because i actually have been using fitness not fitness winner I, so i have the fitbit which it you know tracks all of that stuff as far as like my steps so i necessarily like necessary i don't really have to write this down but i do because i enjoy it um but last week of course i still haven't put any of my stuff in it's thursday and i mean it's not thursday when you see this video it will be thursday but by then this will be filled out so and then it'll be completely filled because i've been tracking my food too so it's not like i haven't been writing that down either so we'll have everything that we need so in the meantime if you enjoy this video you know give me a thumbs up if you haven't already go ahead and click that red subscribe button down below the notification bell next to it and i will see you in the next video